Imagine getting pounded out by a guy on the Wizards. I'm fucking a wizard. <laughs> Ladies and gents, tour dates, tour dates, tour dates. Stand-up comedy, dates, Michael Blaustein. Dates. Where are you going to be? I will tell you. November 2nd, I will be in Raleigh, North Carolina. November 3rd, I will be in Charlotte, North Carolina. November 4th, I will be in Nashville, Tennessee. November 5th through the 7th, I will be in Atlanta, Georgia. November 21st, I will be in San Fran. Those tickets are going, so get on it. And then December 9th, new date. December 9th, I will be in San Diego, California. Uh, go get tickets at BlauComedy.com. Mr. Wallace, where the hell? Oh, I'll H tell you where I'll be. Do it. I'll be Plano, Texas. Sold out. Suck my flaccid penis. Please don't do that. Or if you want. I don't really care. Virginia <laughs> Beach, October 22nd through the 24th. Virginia Beach. Boom, sup, boom. little beach. New Brunswick, New Jersey. Stress Factory. Hey, I'm fucking Jersey. That was terrible. November 4th through <laughs> the 6th. Just added today. New York City. Burn We're going to be at burn. Gotham Comedy Club on November 8th. November 8th! November 8th! Monday, two shows as part of the New York Comedy Festival. Boom. Pull up, pull out. Uh, I'm a Girl Scout. November 18th through the 20th, we're going to be in Jacksonville, Florida. Boom. Sorry to flex. Florida, pull up, you crazy son of a bitches. Denver, Colorado, December 9th through the 11th. Low ticket warning! December 9th through the 11th, Denver, Colorado. Then we're going to be in North Carolina, Charlotte. <laughs> North Carolina, Charlotte, December 16th through the 18th. Nashville, Tennessee, January 6th through nine and then we're gonna have a big tour announcement very very soon and a quick little reminder that we do have a patreon which is four extra episodes a month ad free every friday just the boys how you like it hour long you know what the fuck is going on five dollars every month that's it patreon.com backslash stiff socks pod gabe <laughs> What are we doing now? The episode? <laughs> we're recording right now. Oh, we're recording. Yeah, we're we're going to do an episode right yeah, now. Yeah, right now. This very moment. This is the episode of the week. Comes is it? out. Comes out. Everybody's Wednesday. In their ears. You know what I was thinking about? Give Old it to people low-key got drip. But it's a different huh? kind of drip. They put like pins on and shit. That is kind red of fire. A lot of pins. We said what? Red hats? Old red. ladies with the red hats? Yeah, because Trump. That? No, like they have like they wear like purple dresses and red hats. You never seen this? Red hats. The red hats. Is this I, a this is a common thing that old people know about? Yes. I don't think so. Red babe. hats. Gabe, what, are you on heroin again? <laughs> <laughs> what's the show where they have like kind of fish nets on the side of their head, but it has like little bedazzles? Oh, in the fish, fish nets. nets. Let's but go. It, but it has like bedazzles in it. Oh yeah, they're at the horse races. Yeah, uh, Gabe, what is this? This is the Red Hat Society. It's just ladies wearing purple dresses and red hats. What is this? I've never heard of this. They're hot. Red Hat <laughs> Society. <laughs> Damn. Damn! Bring yes. up that one. Click that one. Their mouths are open. Society. Look at that. What? What is Hold that? Up. Is that like an old age pink cowboy hat society? Because every girl will be rocking the pink cowboy hats in 2021. That's true. I've, Gabe, I've never seen this. What are you talking about? Yeah, this what is, is only this? in Lexington, Kentucky. What do they do? They just, I, I think they just like go to brunch with red hats on. I don't know. I don't I just, think this is not an old about brunch where you're like, I need a hat. <laughs> oh, oh, and yeah. And it's all it's always big. Big. Why does it need to be big? Dude. To put Eggs Benedict in it? Hopefully. All right. I'm just saying. I just... If you're in the Red Hat Society, I think you're a whore. Read this. <laughs> All right. So it comes from, it's a, it's a social club that started in 1997. Horse? Comes from a poem that says, when poem. I am an old woman, I shall wear purple with a red hat, which doesn't go and doesn't suit me. Huh? It's like. Isn't that the colors of Barney? Just like being playful when you get older. So all the old women. Oh, you know what's wild is every person that like ever does anything for like kids TV, they find out eventually they're like a pedophile or a creep. It's like, <laughs> yeah, how did we not put this to it? Yeah, together? someone, this guy is, this guy's literally 43 years old. He goes, I love me. He's fingering kids inside the suit. At, like you they're can't like, Wasn't that. there any red flags when he said he's, he would do the job for free? He'll, <laughs> he'll pay to do it. That wasn't like a, like, this guy's a little sus. I don't know. Red flag society. Uh, red red hat society. Um, red hat. I wonder what the age cutoff is. Or it, not cut off, but or, like, oh, yeah, the, the line where you're like, oh, red hat society. Yeah. What's the young version of that? Hooters. Yeah. <laughs> Hooters. Would you, would you? Where were you at? Where were you at? Where are you at? If your daughter just goes, I got a job, and you go, that's awesome, sweetie. Where are you gonna work? Applebee's, maybe the local landscape and design company. Yeah. And she goes, Hooters. I'll tell you. I go, honey, what the hell is wrong with you? Also, can I get an RSVP reservation tonight for two? <laughs> <laughs> Me and your mom are gonna support you. I mean, dude, Hooters nowadays, it's like it's not as like 
I don't think it's as aggressive as it used to be. It used to be like you had to have triple D's or GTFO. You had to be your, yeah. your tits. You had to bring your food out on top of the tits as a tray. Now yeah. it's just like, I don't, uh, when, did, when did I go there recently? Oh, Yesterday. No. Anyway, no. Um, I but like you see them in malls and shit. It's just like they're just like no, like it's not as like scandalous, seductive. What's the word I'm looking? Both, Sex? both work. Seductive. Yeah, it's it's more like um, yeah, it's there's lo- a lot of ass, a lot it's of ass. Lost its luster. Well, let me ask you this too. What the hell are those goddamn stockings? What? They were like they always wear like these like the socks. Brown, no stockings. What are stockings? <laughs> you know, what's <laughs> like Christmas? <laughs> Hold on. No, I know. Pause the show. You don't know. <laughs> Wait, I don't think they were. Oh, the stockings. Oh, they're like tan. Yeah. Because they make the legs look more tan. Really? But they all wear them. Yeah, it's part of the Let uniform. me see the skin, bro. <laughs> I'm already at Hooters. I already fucking lost my kids at the mall. <laughs> Help me. Let me see your fucking God. skin. God. That alpha though is hot. I don't know what. It, I think it's the, the childhood hotness. That's why I like these. Have you ever seen the chefs at a Hooters? <laughs> these dudes are. <laughs> These dudes couldn't be more excited to clock in. They have never no. had a sick day in their life. What do you mean? <laughs> they have COVID. Like, I'm coming in. Hold yeah. on. Because they need the money or they no, just... No, they're or just, they just stoked want... to see tits. Yeah, dude. They they don't... What do you think they make the wings with? They're cocks. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, so, it's so hard all the time. Yeah. Dude, what do you think they got to do to get a job? Do you the think they just or... fill out the resume? No, the Hooters girls. They think they just filled out the resume. Yeah, that's got to be weird. They're like, where do you see yourself in five years? Probably on a boat with Dan Bilzerian. I don't fucking <laughs> Not here. Yeah. Like, what it like, be like, okay, and your high school, your, your high school. What are your weaknesses? I have a fucking uh, gag reflex. <laughs> Funny. Thanks, man. Yeah, I don't know. I, I would love to, I mean, I would love to interview somebody and just be like, you know, is it, do you get that much better tips working? Like, do you say tips or tits? Tits. 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 Well, dude, think about that, bro. Huh. That's an upgrade. Your boss is like, Miranda, putting in that work. Yeah. You want a raise or do you want double D's? I got you. But, oh. Silicone. Yeah. That's crazy. Um. Yeah, it is weird that you like, you just one day you got an A cup and then you, you, you go in and you come out and you got a D cup and your whole life is different. Yeah. Your and, whole life is different. And you expect people... What I love when people do it uh, is the subtle. They don't tell anybody mm-hmm. on, on the Instagram grid. Yep. All of a sudden, a lot of summer shirts coming out. Oh, yeah. It's December in Louisiana. A lot of, a lot of raspberries over your nipples. Yeah. Hold on. What are raspberry nipples? I don't know. Isn't that a thing? No. I, That's not a thing? I, I literally you say it in a bit. Give someone a raspberry? I, no. I, yeah, I, you I've, go, heard of, I've heard of raspberry Also, nipples. don't do that on a baby. That's just what? odd. That's a raspberry on a baby. Anything on a baby. Odd. Cut it. Get it out. Literally, up. if it's my baby, I have to give it away. <laughs> I don't feel comfortable. I actually love babies. They're so cute. They go, ga ga goo goo. But if I have Raycons in, run it, gay. <laughs> uh, um, <clears throat> what was I going to say? Oh, also, you know what I love when girls get uh, breast implants and they go, because I want to make my shirts fit better. Oh, no. Well, dude. That's, Wrong. Yeah, everybody has like their like reason that they tell yeah. the public, but then deep down, they're like, oh, I got it because blank. It's like when yeah. I bleached my hair. I was like, I got it for a video. You dumb bitch, Trevor. What, you know what you were doing. What, what did you want? What were you like? I, just I was just like, I, I, I've seen people do it online, and I think that it, it grows their uh, their level of hotness. And I was like, dude, what if I was a blonde bad boy? And there's only one way to find out. You know, you could try enough filters where you're like, oh, bleach hair. Whoa, you try it on Instagram. You're like, I could, I could fuck with it. Dude, I've said this a couple of times recently. I really do want to dye my hair. Dye it or bleach it. I think I want to dye it. I don't what know if I want to go blonde. You do? Like maybe like green. Like I think I want to do some kind of nuts. This is so funny. I was literally just th- looking at places to dye my hair purple yesterday. Really? We I should all do some it. Stupid TikTok filter that shows you with your colored hair, and I was like, purple hair with blue eyes looks wow. kind of cool. Wow. Now that's the fucking pink purple shit hat society. Right there we there. go. Oh, yeah. Fuck. Yeah. I mean, dude, but you have blonde hair, right, Gabe? I, yeah, kind Blondish. of Blondish. It's an easier brownish. transformation when you go from like a lighter to like mm-hmm. a color. Like if I just had green hair, people would be like, oh, okay, cool. Maybe pat him down. Pat, make sure he's not strapped up. Yeah, I don't know. I, I want to do like something. I'm going to do like, I don't know. Do a thing? Do a thing. Is this a midlife crisis? What Maybe. is this? I think yeah. I just, yeah. That's a millennial life crisis. Oh, yeah. We could probably find a better title. For it, <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it's yeah. Up there. It's up there. Uh, uh, yeah, I, but th- the hard part is the amount of questions you gotta answer. Yeah, it's like when you break your arm. Yeah, but what yeah, happened? Yeah, that's true. Just immediately, just right on there. 
jack off accident. <laughs> Dude, if you break your arm jacking off, I think you're an Olympian. Yeah. Yeah. Remember that's when, uh, what's his name, the, the swimmer got in trouble for smoking weed? Michael Phelps? Leave him alone. Leave or, him alone. Or the girl that recently got caught. Oh, some, oh no, not her. Uh, Michael Phelps. What, what would you have to do to dye your hair? Like what? Like, whoa, would you do it for Halloween or would you just do it? Or would you do it for uh, Patreon? Or? I would, yeah, if I was going to do it, I'd make it a content, obviously. And I'd, yeah. I'd, I'd bring it to, to, the, to the community. There for sure, there it but is. yeah, I don't, Green? I don't, I don't think, uh, huh. I don't think, uh, I don't think I would do like blonde or like a regular color. Yeah, I think I would do just like, yo, I'm out here. But it is, I feel you with the annoyance of the questions. Yeah, and then I gotta go on stage, and be like, green yeah, hair. Yeah, you gotta have a bit like, about uh, it. You can't yeah. just be up there with green hair, being like, I'll oh, suck a foot, and they're like, well, maybe fungus. let's talk about your yeah. fucking hair. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, honestly, I think if you did have green hair, you, it might be a little more on brand for talking about sucking feet. I think it would be, but then what if you get caught in it? What if you like just have to condemn That's like, your bit? That's your act? It's like, well, people, what if you like, what if I go green hair just for the shit of it because I'm just bored? Yeah. And then all of a sudden socials go, go crazy and I'm like, fuck. That's now, you. Now I'm just stuck in green hair guy? Yeah. That's got to be weird. Girlfriend breaks up with me immediately? Yeah. It oh. would just be a weird sight to see a guy going down on you with green hair. Yeah. Smurf? Smurfs are blue. All of them? <laughs> Maybe ones that haven't showered in a while, a little maybe, green. Maybe I meant trolls. Troll. Do you have a troll doll? Uh, I think I think everybody just had one at least. You That's how I learned remember. how to braid hair. Huh? <laughs> you know how to braid hair? <laughs> Actually, I think every guy does. Yeah. It's just over, over, over. You know, it's just, it's not. What's the difference between a French braid and a regular braid? One goes like this, and one goes ha ha. <laughs> God, that's just that's why French people hate Americans. Yeah. Where's the Where's the country you want to go to that you've never been to, or a place? Where you're like, oh, I want to go there really bad. I want to go to Tokyo. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go to Tokyo really badly, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and I don't really know why. I just feel like it's a cool city. And I honestly have done no research. Is it because you want to feel tall? Well. Michael. Well. Michael. Yes. Yo, that would be sick. Oh, fuck. Now, like, actually, oh, shit. Did now, you play like D2 basketball, bro? No, I actually. What is, what is the average height in Tokyo, Gable, Gableson? And that was a rude gesture to talk about your height like that i'm sorry oh dude talk about it all the, i only i i talk about it. i think it's funny <laughs> yeah you don't even need green hair out there you just existing and they're like dude yeah my buddy i think that guy plays for the wizards <laughs> are they still around or is it the bullets well, no it, it used to versa? be the bullets it is funny that it used to be like, the bullets yeah the let's name a team bullets <laughs> okay a lot of guns crap. yeah guns and they were made of the wizards i think the average height is going to be my height which is very dude, sad imagine getting pounded out by a guy on the wizards i'm fucking a wizard <laughs> Gabe, to me, Gabe. Oh, Gabe. oh no, he's, he's uh, laughing. Five, five foot seven, bro. Oh, you I'm out here. Pull. Oh, yeah. Hey, ham burger, hamburger, dude. I mean it. Oh, speaking of, let me hold on. I I can't believe we didn't start with this. So I got a little S T O R Y. By the whoa, way, whoa, whoa, whoa. You said S T, and I said, <laughs> what's the the third letter? That better not start with a D. But why did they change it? We talked about it before. Why did they change S T D to S T I? It my sounds more like a Subaru. But my <laughs> STI. But my Dodger. It kind of sounds like a Toyota. STI. Well, there is a. I, I think there is a car that's STI. It's a GTI. There's an STI. I think. GTI. That's what my once my mine was Celica, Celica GTI. No GTS. Fuck. Eh, well, I tried. Um. So what's Gabe? I'm so Wait, sorry. Wait. What did you even say? ST. Oh, a story. I got a story. Oh, story. You know what's funny though? Is it about ST blank? Nah. Nah, fuck it's this about, story. It's about my GF. God damn. If you ain't skinning, you ain't winning. winning. Not skinning, like, that's illegal. But skin condoms. Uh-huh. And everything else, dude. S-K-Y-N. What is it? They create products for those who know what they want, want. and who are not afraid to demand, demand it. it. I demand it. I demand having better sex with skin condoms. Those who choose to feel everything, not just in the bedroom, but in life. Hootie. Skin products are designed using the very latest technology to help you and your partner create a truly intimate sexual experience. Sexual, sexual, sexual. From condoms to lubes to massagers and more, SKYN skin products embody our mission to feel everything. Dude, they sent us condoms. They sent us a uh, delay spray. Uh, have you skirt, used that? Skirt. Yeah, I mean, it came in four weeks. Good. Your girl don't want you to come. Your girl want you to... 
bang it out. There it is. And they gave us a buzz buzz dildo. I mean, my girl come 18 times. Buzz, buzz. Now I think she loves a dildo more than me. Guys. True. I Wow, sad, but maybe <laughs> true. Uh, skin condoms, the number one non-latex condoms brand in the world world okay which is ideal for people with latex allergies or latex sensitivities or you had a bad breakup with latex so don't even <laughs> worry about it strength of premium latex offering the same protection against pregnancy 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 does yeah. that right yeah it's a scary word to say and <laughs> stis this is the closest thing to wearing nothing available in a wide variety to enhance sex for both you and your partner how you choose and how do you choose to get it? I'll tell you, it's in a discreet package with free shipping on orders over $30 in the USNA. It's time to spray. All right, so choose to feel everything. Shop skin.com or explore skin on Amazon now. S-K-Y-N.com and explore on Amazon as well. Go get it, put it on, act like you feel nothing, beat it up. Let's go. Hootie who. Goddamn. First I, of all, you were at a football game yesterday. What's that all about? I was scouting. Wh who? For I, her? I was, I was going to see who I was going to kill. But were you watching those men being like, <clears throat> I'll tell you what, bro. I went to a, a Texas, a University of Texas football game. Have we talked since Austin? I don't remember. I don't, we haven't, Where I haven't heard. Where are we? But I was, in, I, was, <laughs> <laughs> I was in Austin. We went to a UT game. Some big boys. And that's just D1. Yeah. Well, I mean... That, that's like that's like a half a step away from NFL. Like those dudes are like high, high, high. No, right, no, that's university. what I'm saying. But like, yes. but like, even the biggest of those dudes might be like on the bench for like the Jaguars. A hundred percent, dude. You said you got pounded out by a Jaguar. That sounds dope. Pounded by a wizard? No, wizards kind of cool. That sounds cool. Wizards cool. I'm Is fucking it? the wizards. I'm like the wizards, damn, Hermione, Jeez. Jesus Christ. <laughs> The Wizards. What's the worst team you could play for <clears throat> that if a girl were to be like, oh, I'm getting fucked by a guy on the blank? Um, Because because of the mascot name or because the team is horrendous? I think mascot name. <sighs> All right. Look, because here's the thing. No matter I got how it. shitty the team. I got it. Yeah, what is it? Browns. Getting fucked by a guy on the Browns. That's not great. Because Browns is bad because the well, team is horrendous. Well, Browns is, it, it just, th there's not a lot of substance. You're just like. Guy on the Browns. Why do they call it the Browns? I'm so sorry to Gabe to like make your fingers work, but yeah, I, I have no idea. Yeah, um, but I will say I recently um, because I was telling my my buddy uh, Neil about my predicament that my girlfriend, um, the last two uh, dudes that she was uh, banging uh, were NFL players. Uh, yeah, you guys heard me right. Um, and he goes, which ones? I showed him. I recently relooked at one of them. He's literally one of the hottest men I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. Like it's it's like it's not even like oh NFL that sucks, but it's like also NFL sucks, but also Double he's whammy. so hot. Hot, jacked, loaded. Loaded. And his eyebrows are perfect. It's like That's I, what I, you noticed on him? Well, I Are you trying to fuck he's him? He's not naked. What's his name? Dox him. All right. Steven Spielberg. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Um <clears throat> yeah, what are some of those shitty names? So the, the the Cleveland Browns do have the most boring name in the world. They're named after uh their first coach, Paul Brown. This is the that's why the team sucks so bad. Yeah, what's the Cleveland people are gonna? What murder is their it. mascot? Just somebody being like, "Hey, hey, I'm Paul." <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's the other bad one though? What's it? There's gotta be like a hockey team. Oh, there's a hockey team like named like the Blues. Yeah, I'm getting Nashville, fucked by the Blues. Is it? <clears throat> Get fucked by the Blues. Kings is not. Kings is fine. Kings is chill. Dude, my my buddy's last name is King, and we were like, dude, and he's having a new Steven? kid. Steven? Uh, maybe. But Stephen King? No. The no. writer? No, no, You sir. know him? No, maybe. God. Um, but we were talking about what he should name his next kid. And he thinks we in should. In the castle. No. King in the castle. Disney's the lion is the first name. Solid. Disney's the lion? That's solid. King? The kid is just a walking meme, though. Oh, my God. Yeah, he get fought immediately. Yeah. He's in bed being like, talk dirty. And she's like, ha, Savannah, <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Oh, come in, yeah, I'm with. Yes. Dude, that's what happens. Um, <clears throat> so, I was at a football game. Yeah. And I was looking at the guys. And I had a pretty good seat. Okay. They looked Whoa, big. Flex. They looked, <laughs> it wasn't even my tickets. My buddy had, uh, uh, what I call it, season tickets. 
They look, they're so big from even far away. That's what I'm saying. No, at the UT game, we stood where they walked out. I was on the field. Oh, flex. So I, Got it like I went, that? I, dude, I, I went with uh, your boy. Oh. Uh, da, da, da. Your agent. Yeah. Your yeah. agent got yeah. me, got me uh, the field level tickets or whatever. It Crazy. Like. It was awesome, man. Um, yeah, they're massive. And then, Big, but that's what I'm saying. This was college. Yeah, they're... had a couple steroids and a couple of goddamn beef stroganoffs. First of all, I went to a restaurant. Yeah, that, that was the second item on the menu was beef stroganoff. I would leave. <laughs> we did. I swear <laughs> on my life, we left. We left. Why'd you leave? The menu was very <laughs> mid, and um, we were sitting for like five minutes, and the waiter was like, "I'll be right there. I'll be right there." And right, then right. they never did. And yeah. then you know, it's funny is I check on my phone to see where other places they had, and the place we ate at in San Antonio a bunch. Yeah. First watch, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Remember that? Yeah. They had one across the street. I was like, what are we doing here? Oh, that's beautiful. The first watch was so good. Yeah. No, it's perfect. But it is awkward when you leave a restaurant because they're like, oh, are you guys leaving without paying? We're like, oh, no, we didn't even order. And like, wait, why didn't you order? Because you have beef stroganoff coming in number two. Also, th the whole thing sucks. Yeah. This whole thing sucks. It had the word bistro in it. Nothing with, with bistros getting me rocked I told up. you. The, I told you. <laughs> I told you the time that I got patted down in front of a French bistro, right? Huh? Yeah, I told you the story. Was that a part of the menu? Uh, oh shit! Yeah, lobster frisk. <laughs> Kick ah, it! <laughs> it's not bad, right? It's really not bad. It's really not bad. Lobster <laughs> frisk, dude. You think anyone ever got rocked up when they were at the airport and they got patted down? The answer yeah. is yes. I've I've been mildly chubbed when. Pause <laughs> the game. What do you mean? Well, there's the airports get you horned up, and if you got the right sweatpants on. The airports get you horned up. They don't do that for you? At the airplane, when I'm on the airplane, Air rocked up. Uh, airplane, something about the pressure, I've said this a hundred times, gets me hard. That's why look, That's why you your boy jerk it, off in a goddamn airplane I've been bathroom. hard everywhere. <laughs> oh, yeah. Probably. I, I, look, I've been hard on about, this podcast for sure. how many flights we've taken in the last three years? Yeah, a billion. At one point, yeah. somewhere, you got a little fucking yeah. out of Hudson News. You're a little cocked up. Hudson News. Isn't it funny that they're nowhere else? Just chilling. But they don't have a Hudson News like outside. Like there's not a Hudson News on Melrose. Because it's a conspiracy theory. You think so? Yeah. What do you mean? <laughs> it's ran by the government. <laughs> Birds aren't real, but what you got they... first down. Uh, really big football players, and then you're gonna talk about your GF. Yes. So I just when I think about these football players that I actually saw them in action, you they're big, but you also couple it with their athleticism, and then it just all goes downhill. Because I've blocked it out of my brain that it didn't exist. Two yeah. in a row. Yeah. How do you go football player, football player, a oh, jester? It's called a handoff. Kick it. God damn. It's called a downgrade. <laughs> she went from an iPhone to a goddamn Samsung. Are you a Samsung? Yes. Okay. She went from a... Because you want green hair. Green text. God damn. These are really good. You're killing yeah. it right now. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Um, what is the point of all this? I'll tell you. Well, you brought the football game, but I wasn't going to talk oh, about no, that. Oh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm just trying to see where this is. Uh, like, did you have a revelation at the football game? Oh, I did bring it up. You know, I was just, yeah, I was just at a football game. I got 100 DMs being like, is that a fucking, you guys better be looking at the Rams game. You fucking, your girls like, doesn't love you. Yeah, 38 yeah. were from me. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> all right, blah, 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 football game. It was fun. Anyways, so to the story. So we were having uh, the Pound Town Sexy Sex. Whoa. Yeah, we were doing it. And, uh, haven't uh, really are you a big come on the face guy i when the opportunity arises mr miyagi god <laughs> damn. damn wax on sex off yeah. this is my best episode in a while <laughs> <laughs> everyone at home was like that wasn't that yeah like, it wasn't that great this is fun wax on sex off what's sex off your sack is off. You're, you're getting a, a load oh, off your, your sack. sack is coming. Sack, ball sack. I get it. I get it. I get it. Because your penis kind of looks like a sack. Potato sack. Well, your cock. Is it cock and balls? Like, are they separate? Cock and bull. Bar in Santa Monica. Let's go. <laughs> um, come on the face. Come if, on. if I'm, uh, you know, if I have, you know, access granted. Yeah. Oh, oh, God, fucking come on your face. The biggest thing is. You, you got to get the access granted. Well, yeah. You can't just oopsie daisy surprising no, poo -poo. no, 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 no. Um, yeah. Because uh, how girls plan it is very funny. Like, I've asked, and she's like, oh, no, I already have my makeup done. Yep. <laughs> we have to go to brunch after this. And yeah. I'm like, yeah, just tell them you were crying. Yeah. Also, 
Also, this is this is like how do you think of logistics when you're going that is true down. if my but i think a girl at any given moment can be like what does my day look plans. like do I, do I need to have makeup do i need to have my shit together but if it's at the end of the night and there's no makeup uh then it's free range i mean dude I, I, when i'm hard and horny like there's no there's no like oh let me figure out excel spreadsheets let me see i'm gonna be late for the 15 no i'll yeah. i'll miss my dad's funeral if i'm fucking i don't know what's <laughs> happening i don't know what's happening you know yeah. Um, <clears throat> right. So I get. So I realize that we haven't done it, and I'm feeling a little. Frisky. You've never done it ever. No. Somehow it. Wait. Yes or no? No. I mean, I've done. I. Yeah. No, with her. No, with her. No. No. Oh, yeah. No. Somehow it always ends up in the eye. You could aim for her chin, and then it's like we'll see about that. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Always. I mean, well. That's when I feel bad because he gets in the eye and she has really red eyes. Well. Well, this is where we're going, Daddy Johnson. Oh uh, shit! Yeah. So. Bullseye. So I used to have a bit back in the day, day that I was just like. Um, like I, I can tell I like a girl because I don't want to just come on her face. I don't want to just come on her face. I want to help her clean it up afterwards. And go. that's how you can tell you love a girl. You don't want to just come on her face, right? So as I'm coming on the F A C E spells face backslash stiff, right? So I'm coming on the face, and immediately I like as I'm coming, I grab her on the shoulder. I go close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes. I'm coming and I close your eyes, close your eyes, right? Did you? Did you like? I'm gonna get another in your face. Oh yeah, yeah. why? Was she going into it eyes open? Yeah, yeah. She with with. Yeah, <laughs> she's like reading a chart at the doctor's <laughs> office. C U M. Oh, I, come. I hate that glaucoma shit. That glaucoma test, where they blow it in your eyes. What? Oh, your There's dentist a test where they blow air in your eyes. Yeah, you never got that glaucoma test. No. Hold on. Hold on. Yes, you guys have, man. It's the whole thing. No. My my eye doctor always does it, but instead I think of your eye doctor doesn't like you. <laughs> guys, don't tell me that both you guys have never got the never glaucoma had, test. No. no, I've never. You've never had the eye open thing and they go no, and they blow air. Nineteen twelve. What are you this talking thing? about? This is it. They blow air in your eye. I've what done, is I've, going maybe, on? May, I mean, yes. I've done the one. Did I ever tell you that I really wanted glasses growing up? So I told the doctor I was yeah. colorblind. Yeah. Colorblind? No, you didn't say that part. You said you wanted glasses really bad. My niece just got glasses. I thought being colorblind was dope. So he'd show me something that was blue and I'd be like, purple? And he's like, uh, well, <laughs> I just thought that was like, a, I thought you could like, back when you were like middle school, that was the way that like girls big. He's so dangerous. He can't see colors. I thought it was like cool. I thought it was like cool flex because I met some kid who was colorblind. I was like, it's kind of dope, dude. <laughs> Guy has now no it's just, idea. His now shirt it's kind of just orange. like like a like a woke flex. I don't see color. You also don't see vagina. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. What's that? Precise. I price. can't hear you because oh. I have new Raycons in, baby. Oh. Look, I'm tired of hearing all this jibber jabber on airplanes. Oh, goo goo gaga, give me Wah. a tit. Wah. Yeah, must be nice. Look, if you're traveling <laughs> and you want to, dare I say muffle or block out the inconvenience yeah. of other sounds and you just want that quality you want that bass for the face and the fucking face <laughs> face I got it. I had it it's time for Raycons what are they they are the best everyday earbuds that look feel and sound great whether you use them to pump up wind down work or workout Raycons are my go to for on the go audio they fit in your pocket they have an insanely long charge time it's something like 8 hours of playtime and 32 hours of battery life but let me ask you this how's the Ask bass away. buddy bass for your face i feel like i'm in a Nicki minaj music video every single goddamn day boom 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 i literally feel like my girl is a uh, boom boom in her butt on my head every single time i listen to it boom boom bang 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 maybe cut it but who cares all right <laughs> there's also an all new awareness mode for when you need to listen to your surroundings instead uh raycon started half the price of other premium audio brands but they sound just as good and raycon comes with, ooh, comes, sorry, cut that. And Raycon <laughs> comes <it>. with 45 day happiness guarantee. We all love happiness. So if you put it in your face and you don't like it, which won't happen, you have 45 days to be guaranteed and you love them. They support the show. We support them. So if you want to get hooked up today, go to buyraycon.com slash socks. That's buyraycon, R-A-Y. C-O-N.com slash socks to save 15% off. That's buyraycon.com. Slash socks. Socks. Goddamn. Yeah. 
<laughs> um, okay. All right. What? Where are we at? Both of you guys had never got the glaucoma test. Maybe I've I've done the thing where you put your chin on the. the yeah. Well, that. Yeah. That's that. Yeah. There's no. Yeah. There's a thing. But you've never got the in the eyes. I don't think so. What that is going on? Sounds like on? hazing. It's awful. It's the worst thing ever. Yeah. They go. All right. Anyways. You ever so, like you ever like blown air at your like dog or cat? You. Uh, and then yeah. Oh, and they, they try to bite it. They get so angry. They try to bite it. I'm just trying to see. They're like, what poked me? I don't see anything poking me. If you really think about it, uh, animals are dumb. Whoa. Yeah, they're pretty yeah. stupid. Yeah, they're pretty dumb. Greta's mm -hmm. an idiot. Oh, she has a new trainer. Killing it, by the oh, way. Oh, is this the uh, the one that's going to like fully bring her back to life? Oh, she's like... She's like... Not... You don't want to get rid of her anymore? She's not insane anymore. I mean, less. She's still insane, but she's not 100% insane. She's probably like 80% at this point. She's like really... It's, it's great. Anyways, everyone is screaming, get back to the cum on the face. Cum. Because we're talking about fucking Greta. Who yeah. cares? All right. So I get mission granted. All right. Or permission granted. I apologize. Mission granted works. Does it? Mission. Oh, yeah. It's a mission. Mission. mission Harry. Impossible cum. So <clears throat> I'm, um, sorry, um, I, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> so. Light him. <laughs> so she. What if you could get lit? Doing on your sex. own podcast? No, doing oh. sex. Come. Funny. Come. Funny. All right. Being lit is a well, comedy that term. Is, that when, I, oh, when, go, go when, you're, when you're like, when you're wrapping up, that means if you get the light of the comedy show, it means like wrap up. It means like you have one more minute or yeah. two more minutes. But here's the funny thing about that. If you think about it, when your girl asks you to come, that is her giving you the light. Come. Because, yeah, because that's her being like, I'm done. Come. So come. we can go to sleep. Come. Yeah. She goes, come for me, daddy. Does she really want you to come? Probably not. She, but she's like, let's fucking, I'm done. I'm done. Yeah, here. Let's yeah. wrap it up. Yeah. All right. So she goes, I get permission granted. She gets on her knees. And then as I'm coming, I'm like, I'm like, close your eyes, baby. Close your eyes. Close, close your eyes. So I'm coming. It's like weird, right? So then she gets obviously in her, both of her eyes. <laughs> come in both of her eyes. Did you fucking move? Like it was a I was trying game? to like, I was trying to avoid, but obviously I did the opposite. What did you aim for? Just center of face? What did I aim for? The <laughs> doesn't does I was just I was just, who's who's aiming? I'm not aiming. But you're just like like were you going for forehead or you just whatever's in front of you? Whatever's in front of me. Gotcha. I, I wasn't. So I you get it in both eyes. I right? get it in both eyes, right? Yeah. <clears throat> and uh, and her eyes are all semen. She can't see shit. Can't this is my episode. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. Um, it's not even funny. Um, <laughs> so you get it in both eyes. No, no, claim it. Claim it. It's your episode. This is my it's episode. so funny. No. All right. All right. Okay. Back so on track. It's in both eyes. It's in both eyes. <clears throat> so I go, we go to sleep, wake up the next morning. And uh, you didn't clean it out? No. We did, we, we, we did the whole. We She's did like, the well, whole. my eyes are shut. I'll just go to bed. <laughs> We did the whole thing. I get got her a towel, put a little water on it, did the whole day. Yeah, 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 yeah. I came again. Yeah. <laughs> you like go, go, go. Okay, so she's red, right? She goes to sleep. Wake up the next morning. And I'm like, Are you you okay? Like, is your eyes better? And uh and she was like, She's like, Yeah, it's, I mean, my eyes are like a little better. So my, so, you know, my first time. And I go, Wait, she goes, That wasn't my first time? Well, no, she goes, That was my first time. Oh, first time. And I go, How was your first time you ever got come on your face like have you ever had a dude come on your face and she goes oh no 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 <laughs> hot hot hike i go i go don't say it like it's, that the fucked up part is is like there's that mid like confidence yes. in you where you're like oh i was the first she says, oh no 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 oh, no 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 it was our I, first time yeah no i mean dude she, she goes my face is a goddamn cinnabon you <laughs> think that i've not had a little bit of squirt sweet oh it was the most confidence that it was just it's been Funny. it's been crispy cream glazed donut uh plenty of times yeah. the sign is up it's warm come get the donuts yeah. that's what it was i was I, 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 so what is what was she referring to the first time our first time. Oh. Uh, yeah. Our first time. Yeah. Clearly not her first time. Upset. Not really upset. It's <laughs> what did totally you say fine. to that? Uh, she, I killed her. She's dead. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, she's dead. Um, no, I just laughed for fucking twenty minutes, and I was like, no. "This is you can't." You Were they me? like sad laughs? Like ah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is interesting. It's like you, you ever start talking <clears throat> with your significant other about like their exes or something, and then it gets like a little too deep, and you're like. What, why are we talking about this? Yeah, here, here's, I mean, you had sex with other people, and then you picture another dude 
on their face. Yeah, I'm not. A, you know what's weird? I got like lines. Usually yeah. my lines, I don't really have a lot of lines. I got li that visual doesn't do it for me. I'm going to be honest though. And we've maybe discussed this before. My girl getting banged out. Kind of hot. Weird. But it's from like, like, like a video of like her ex <laughs> banging her out. Like you'd watch. I would watch that. Yeah. Really? I think I would watch it live in action. See, I couldn't do that because if if the noise level of the moans were higher yeah. than what usual, you're, right? I'd be like, we gotta break up. I think they're gonna be. If there was one octave that's higher than ah, uh, we're done. You don't get higher than that. It's a pretty low octave. You get a few. You get a few. Yeah. Pillow yells. That's what makes you feel good. Oh, the pillow yells. Or she goes, you're gonna wake up the neighbors. Good. Good. Also, good. my neighbor plays the guitar. It, Fuck him. Yes, hundred percent. Scream, bitch. Dude, when I move out of this new place, I think I'm just going to pull a blow and just come yes. freely. Yes. I'm just going to be I like, it this. must be 6 a.m. because the sprinklers are tick, 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 going off. You know what I love? Let's make that a page on episode. Let's watch it. Okay. Let's watch you just come on the grounds. Yeah. I love it. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So that that was... the. You're okay. So you're not okay with uh, the group, the group uh, SEX. You're not. You you wouldn't be. You wouldn't be okay venturing down that. What do you mean? With your with your girl. I'd no. I'd do it. <laughs> I just want to watch an old like I like if I'm in the you know, like what do you mean group sex? Like, group sex like like we're it, banging and then we fucking do a little switchy swap. Yeah. Not with me, <laughs> but like a switchy swap. Who is it? Uh, Gabe and his girl. Yeah. Gabe's got that 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 wagon though. Right. I mean you're fucking Gabe. That's what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> there we now that's a party. Now that's a party. Um, um you you wouldn't be okay with it? You couldn't No, I'd do it. Yeah, I think I I, I think I would, I would really much there, enjoy it. Right? Oh yeah. But I'm saying couple couples flop. So you're Am I in the same room? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same yeah. bed. Same yeah, that's that's fun. That's teamwork. That's team building. Yeah, but then but then it's I mean a company outing. But just what? Come company outing. Penny outing. But just uh, walk yourself through it. You gotta, you know, you gotta. You're gonna be next to your girl, getting banged out by some uh, other dude. But the group aspect of it is yeah, kind of hot. The the weird is if I'm watching a video and I'm not there, then I'm like, I want to see this shit. Yeah, but there's is something hot about. It. Well, you know what I don't want to see. To be quite honest, I do not want to see like other boyfriends penis size. Like that would that would fuck me up. So, I don't know if you know about group sex. It's kind of hard to avoid. You're like, yo, bro, put that shit away and put it in my girlfriend. Jesus Christ, let's be responsible here. I just, wouldn't you do some reconnaissance? What? Take it out. Take it out before we go to this group sex. Like, you, both y'all go, go. No. Oh, no? I ain't doing any of that. I'm, I'm just, just literally, I'm dice? head down. I'm head down. Uh, you know, it's like when you see somebody that you got to walk past in the hallway that you're kind of awkward with. You're like, I don't want to, yeah. whether it's school or work. You yeah. just put your head down and you keep moving. That's what I do. I'd be, I'd be here, yeah. right? Doing the doggy dog style, right? And then I'm I'm walking over, head down, head down. Maybe uh, you see a little bit of feet graze past you. Yep. But then you just fucking Chinese fire drill that bitch. That's so hot. I'm so into it. I'm like getting a little chubbed up thinking about it. Let's say you're having the group S space E space X yep. sex. Yep. Are you doing it with a couple you know or randos? Gotta be randos. Yeah. Because the thing is, like, you don't want to do it on like a like a friend vacation, and then you have to like see them. Yeah, but in what two if that's your guys like, Fridays? What if that's your guys like little inside joke that's funny? You're like, haha, let's go play spike ball, then let's fucking spike each other's balls. <laughs> But this is this is the problem with that is I feel like that leads to something horrendous. I feel like that uh, okay. leads to like all of a sudden you're like, oh, uh, sweetie, where are you? Like, all oh, sudden, you and me Genevieve, and Brian bro. are at Target together. You're like, wh yeah. why? You, if why, you go what are doing? to a Target with the opposite gender of you, y'all are fucking. Dude, are Target fucking. is a horny place. If somebody, if I call my girlfriend, she's like, oh, I'm at Target with your buddy Michael. I'm like, what aisle? Please say Starbucks. Has to be. What's a, what's an aisle that you're fine with? The toy section? Starbucks. That's it. That, oh. Oh, God. we're stopping to get Starbucks for you because your show's next. Any any aisle. No. What? Uh, you what can about make, the, what you about can make the tech any aisle horny. What about the tech aisle? What do like you the need, TVs what, and shit. Well, oh, what are you buying a TV for? A new studio apartment? 
I'll tell you what, you know what, you know what the lead, the, the, the number one aisle that I do not want to hear? The bath, the bath towel aisle. Like that? It's such a horny aisle. Any, anyone is horny. Toothpaste? Not that horny. While you're brushing your teeth. That's true. You should smell as bad as possible around this man. You need to be gross. Yeah. Why do you need a bath towel? Unless she's like, oh, we're literally getting motor oil? Acceptable. That's lube. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Never mind. There's no aisle. Never mind. I think that's what I'm saying. I think the TV section. So the baseball is card aisle. Jesus. Target always has like baseball cards and Pokemon. It's like a, it's the first aisle when you walk in on your left. Or they have that little island. They have like that mini store inside the store. It's like it's their seasonal shit usually, or it's yeah. like the really cheap stuff. What's Who, that? Who's in there? A lot of people. True. <sighs> are you excited? For, are you a Halloween guy? No. Yeah. Zero emotions for it. Past fifteen, I don't care about holidays. It's a meme to me. Dumb. The lady's like, we got to watch Halloween Town. She puts it on. Ten minutes later, she's on her phone. I'm like, you don't care about the movie. You you, yeah. you post it on Instagram and say, spooky season. Yeah, you you want to be like, look what I'm doing with my bow. With your what? Bow. Bow? Yeah, bow's like a boyfriend. Huh? Yeah. Who? I, now I feel like I made it up, but I didn't make no, it up. That's real. Yeah, oh, B-E-A-U. With your bow. Your bow. B-E-A-U. Beautiful. Bow? Bow. I thought what? you brought it up. Yeah, with your bow. Like your fucking, that's yeah. A, no. Yeah, that's a watch. Look at the internet. Sucked off by bow? I mean, you wouldn't Bo say Jackson. that. You sucked off by your bow. Can girls uh, say I got sucked off? Yeah. Yeah. That's funny. I got if, sucked off. Here's the thing. If anyone could say that it should be a girl, because you really suck a fucking vagina. You and don't really a suck a, you, you don't really suck a dick. You don't go, what? you don't suck it. You kind of just move your mouth up and down on it. Yeah, but there's, there's a... When I sucked. <laughs> I feel like everybody's sucking. Is it... Is there some, a, do you have to pop off at the end? When that's you're, true, but When I you're getting the last of the toothpaste, a.k.a. cum gate out. Cum gate? Can you use it to, to brush your teeth? Is it like good? Cum? Yeah. You can use anything to brush your teeth. A lot of vitamins. Kool-Aid jammers. That. Whoa. <laughs> What's this, Bo? What does that say? This is it's literally. a boyfriend or male admirer. Admirer. Stupid. I hate it. The word admirer is weird. What do you? Yeah, but look at that. The, the analog. Analogous. What, what are these What'd words? You say? Analog. Wait. Where do you see that? There's what somebody named Bo Biden. No, Man's name. Joe is, Biden. No. Look, <laughs> it says Bo Biden. Is that Dad is it? Joe Biden? Oh, pass what? away. What? Pass away. Uh oh. R. I. P. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Change the channel. <laughs> Change the channel. Change the podcast. No, but it says the Damn. analogous female term is girlfriend. That's such a... Wait, I'm so lost. A bow is for a boyfriend. I'm girlfriend. My mind. Girlfriend is, is bitch. This guy. A bow bitch. Bo Burnham. Bo, a funny comic. Is his name Boyfriend Burnham? No, but Bo is B-O. But how do you say this one? Bo. Bo. How, do you, how do you spell it? B-E-A-U. Okay, now what's that comedian's name you were just talking about? Bo. Okay, what's the difference? Bo, it's two different words. No, it ain't. B O uh, Bo. Say it. Bo. <laughs> I almost plugged my ears. Bo. Okay, now Bo. say the other one. Now say the other one. Bo. Okay, now say the other one. Bocephus? Oh, whoa, 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 these are all the same to me. Let me ask you this. Is Bo short for Bocephus? I'm going to name my first kid Bocephus Blouse. I don't know what Bo Bocephus means. I think it's just another, I think it's just a, a elongated version of Bo. Bocephus. I can't believe you know how to spell Bo Cephas. He didn't spell it. Oh. Uh, Bo's not actually short for him. Well, Bo? fuck me. Uh, Bo? I don't know. Is what Bo short was, for what, William? What book was Boo Radley? Catcher in the Rye. Was it? No. Boo Greg Radley. Gatsby. Boo no. Radley. To Dude, Kill that... a Mockingbird. To Kill Exactly. Wow. That's what I said. Why, is it, why does that guy have a, a lightsaber? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Dude, that sounds like somebody who makes whiskey. Boo Radley. Dude, I had so much bourbon in Lexington. Why? Because the guy who opened Rocky Dale Davis, a very funny man, uh, he's super into bourbon. Yeah. So he went to a new distillery like every day to get a bottle. He was like, small batch, you can only buy this bottle. You know. It, I wish I had hobbies. Like, didn't it sound cool to be dude, like, the way oh, he I'm talked about it, it like made me like a little like moist in certain places. He'd be like, this is like a, this is E.H. Taylor Woodford Reserve. I don't know if that's right. Please don't fact check me. But then he, but it was like, this is, it, then he was just hitting the details. And I'm like, yeah. was, I was like, yeah, oh, whoa, yeah, all right. And then I'd try it and I'd be like, this, this is awful. This, this, out of the three he brought, two of them beat my ass. One of them was like, suit, like, I was like, oh, I can sip on this. 
I need just fucking. Do you put like a large ice cube in it? Or no, that's disrespectful. Warm? That's how just you get your ass beat in Kentucky. Yeah, it's called neat. Neat. Put ice in there. Why are we all trying to prove things to people? You know, when people are like, I drink a lot. You're 39. <laughs> What the fuck are you t- saying to me? Why yeah, Why is yeah. that so cool? People are like, oh, gee, I ate seven beers and then I went out. Know, man. What? It's, what? Yeah, I don't know. It I, was, It was. Uh, but yeah, you know, I'd pour myself a little shot like every night yeah. and like, sit by it. And then I'd closely have a water bottle next to me in case nobody was looking. I'm like, chaser. Yeah, I have to. I can't yeah. just drink. It was good though. There's some good stuff. I just, I, I'm just uh, impressed that people have hobbies. And I really wish, I was listening to Joe Rogan this morning. Whoa. Fucking, because I'm, because I'm me. Elite, yeah. Yeah, very elite. And he's just talking about being like a well-rounded person. I'm like, I would love to be that. What is your hobby? I don't know. I don't know either. I don't have one. I like just do videos, do stand up, record a podcast. Me too. And scroll TikTok till my eyes are bleeding. That's literally all, that's that's all I do. I jerk off a little bit. I have sex yeah, a little yeah. bit. I play golf a little bit. That would be the only thing that I'm like, what's your hobby? I'd be like, I guess golf. Strokes. Different folks. No, I'm just saying you just be stroking shit. That's golf clubs, do, bro. cock, strokes. Strokes. Why is it called a stroke? You have Strokes a, could mean anything, really. You have a stroke. You do strokes on a golf course. You do strokes you, in a pool. Strokes on a pool. There's you a do stroke strokes. in a car. Stroke? Yeah, stroke in a car? What? I don't know. Is there? Did I just make that up? Stroke? Stroke in stroke? a car. Uh, yeah, something something stroke engine. Like an yeah. engine has like strokes? four or eight Chokes. strokes. Strokes. Better help. <laughs> <laughs> I think we just I think oh we just had a stroke. A stroke! <clears throat> Why do they say when you're about to have a, a stroke it smells like burnt toast? It's kinda I, it's I, kinda cool. I just think I just think that Not that's really, what your brain but... smells. Yeah, this I don't is know. a science podcast like a motherfucker, dude. Oh, dude, ain't like this kind so of wait, stuff, what, Oh, Joe uh, Rogan podcast. This kind of stuff freaks me out. Like having like brain aneurysms. You ever hear about that? Yeah. Like, oh, Timmy was 21. He had a brain aneurysm. Jesus. You're You're just, predicting it. It just happens. It just happens. Yeah. yeah. How do you just walk around life knowing that? We just forget all this stuff. Yeah. You just can have an aneurysm. Yeah. You can just get attacked by a bobcat. You can just get decapitated dude, was, by a sliding glass door anytime. That was literally like the worst show ever. It was like a thousand ways to die. I was like, I will never watch this TV show. This is terrifying. But there, I think that separates a, a, like a functioning person from a non-functioning person. A functioning person can be like, I know all this, but who gives a fuck? The odds are zero. Yeah. And you walked on the street. A non-functioning person just like is agoraphobic and has to stay it, like just sleep in the refrigerator. You die there. It, damn. <laughs> I think that is on an That's episode. one of the of thousand ways. ways. To die they would be, a refrigerator? They would be horrendous. I think I would like it was like on Spike TV or something, the fucking most alpha channel in the world. But it'd be like a guy got shit on by a bird and then he went to like wipe his eye and then he turned into a bus. And they would have actors reenact this. That's a great gig. Mom, guess what I booked? A guy who got hit by a fiat. Now I'm famous. Yeah. You can stop paying my T-Mobile meal about now. Are you Mom. still on your parents' phone bill? No. Okay. Are Are you? Are you about to tell me that you're still on your parents' phone bill? No, you're not, dude. Hey. Trevor. I Venmo my mom, but. No, you <laughs> don't. <laughs> it's, it's too it's too complicated. Dude, hold on. I don't want to change my number. Yada, oh, yada, yada. Oh, I'm going to oh, pause. I'm going to pause right now. I would like to say that you Venmo your mom for your phone bill. Yeah. So she doesn't pay for it. No. Okay, well, that's what I do. <laughs> you, you're just giving him a super hard time and you do the same thing? Well, yeah, because I thought you meant, I don't, for some odd reason, I thought you meant like you're, you're just still in your mom page for it. Like you, you just, No, no, they just take it up. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I have to vet my sister. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Dude, I'm sorry. Yeah, but my mom was like, recently, she was like, we should talk about you getting your own phone bill. I was like, I call Verizon and be like, hey, what can we do for you? Hey, you want to get a new iPhone? Hey, I do need a new iPhone. This piece of shit. I can't believe you still have it. I can't even save videos from anything. It, it's a piece of shit. I can't believe you still have it. Is it like a, uh, what's it called? What, are we, what am I talking about? Uh, uh, like a super citizen thing? No, I like, just, I hate doing things that are just going to slow down whatever I want to do that day. It's it like, really oh, does. I got to go to Verizon. This is a whole thing. It's a whole day. It's a whole day. Dude, that's why I won't get my uh, car tinted. Because I'm just like, this is, 
I'm gonna wake up on Tuesday and like that's going to be my Tuesday. That's your Tuesday. So and, and you're like, what do I do for these two hours? Do I go fuck off somewhere? Do I? I hate that. I'm just yeah. go to Starbucks and pretend I'm reading. Yeah. What yeah, are scones? And, what? What are scones? Hard croissants. All right. Just wanted to ask. Yeah. God damn. You know what's the scariest thing of spooky season? Huh? Having some spooky leaves down by your cock with no reason. Uh, bars! Get a goddamn manscape so you can shave your balls, give your fucking top thing a little fade, maybe put a Nike check, maybe a yeah. Puma. Jack o' lantern, Jack yo lantern. Look, okay. ladies and gentlemen, you know what the fuck going on. Let's go. It is manscaped, all right? And look, just because it's getting a little colder doesn't mean you can start, you know, slowing down on trimming the hedges, all right? If anything, you should pick it up because now we're turning into cuddle season, spooky season, uh -oh. you know? The last surprise that she wants to say is go, woo -woo, is when you pull your pants down. Also, so do you want to woo, -woo or do you want to uh, -huh, uh -huh. You decide. Can you I decide? Just, you I'd decide. Like, I just like to say this real quick. Yeah. Um. Do you ever want your peepee -pee to look bigger? Uh... Say yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. And that's why you got a goddamn manscape. Shave the hedges down and your pee pee looks bigger. Okay. You don't even need to get surgery. I'll get surgery, but you don't need to get surgery. Yeah. Okay. Unlock your confidence with the performance package 4.0. Inside, you'll find the holy grail of men's grooming items. You've made it easier for you to upgrade your grooming route. Teen, okay look you guys already know what it is it's a trimmer for your boss or you know you could probably fade up the homie with it if you want i would do it you want are you asking me gabe cut the cameras time for a haircut <laughs> anyways dude it's got a light on it an led light it's waterproof waterproof you could fucking shave your nutsack in the goddamn atlantic ocean how many times have you charged it Zero. Zero. Still to this day like literally zero it's been in my shower i use it maybe twice a week yeah and it it just Twice doesn't weed. die. Yeah. Oh. oh, my shit looks fresh consistently. Uh, I, I want you to. Sh I want to show you. My shit is always fresh. Show me. All right. Also, it was raining pretty hard last night. I was a little nervous. Yep. And I was like, dude, if this power goes out, you know what I'm grabbing? Huh. Not my phone. I'm no. grabbing the motherfucking Manscaped. It's got a great LED light on it. Sometimes I use it when I uh, fix a car engine. Look, I just got <laughs> it on ready to go. Ladies and gentlemen, we've been talking about Manscaped since day one. They are awesome. We truly, truly do yes. uh, love them. They have all types of products. They have body sprays. They have uh, ball deodorant. They have wipes. They have literally everything. So even if you're not even looking for, if you already have a Manscaped the shaver, but check out their website. They have a whole bunch of stuff you won't even know is ready for your fucking sack, baby. Yeah, so if you go. sacked up trying to get that ass touched, go to manscaped.com slash stiff to get 20% off whoa. plus whoa. free shipping manscaped.com slash stiff 20% off m-a-n-s-c-a-p-e-d.com slash stiff 20% off free shipping go do it we love you god damn yeah I'll, I'll get a new phone eventually but it's just like come to my house and do it you can probably just order one online bro but then the setup is all yeah 100% it's it's <laughs> it's so easy it's really not hard I just Setting, dude, it's like, I, I, the way I live my life is not the best way. Like, half my shit is on the iCloud. The other half is just, like, somewhere. What do you mean? Like, n my phone isn't backed up. It's not? Not backed up. Half of it is, but I ran out of space. And then I went to try and buy it. And then I was like, what's your iCloud? I was like, I don't fucking know any of this stuff. Does just, anyone I know just, their iCloud? I, you, know. You, I just live every day being like, whatever. We'll figure it out. Yeah, I don't, that, I'm not productive in the best way possible. I spend money rationally, very rationally, but then my phone will break and I'm like, oh, I could have backed up everything on the iCloud yes. for $25 in the past 20 months, mm -hmm. or I can be like, well, that's where their fo those photos go. They're gone. I don't need them. Also, do you need them? I don't know. I'm There's so, so much stuff that is on my iCloud that I don't On my phone, need. it's just screenshots. Just being like, oh, leave this funny meme, screenshot. Or I'll screenshot something so I try and remember it later. Yeah. But what am I going to look through my screenshots and be like, no. oh, well, that was the fish bowl I wanted. There was uh, the fish. Only, people own them. Idiots. People own big fish. People own like. Aquariums are tight. The ones that are like in houses. Yes. Cool. Fish bowl. Weird. Let them be free. Yeah. If you're if you're over 20, you have a, you have a goldfish. <laughs> huh? <laughs> what are you doing? I almost feel, I almost feel bad. I'm like, it's. Yeah. I what do. is this for? Yeah. If you do that, you should always wear a condom. <laughs> There's certain people that you're like, all right, if you're this person, the, yeah. you should never come in somebody. It's that. If you got a goldfish or if you still have your snapback hats above your bed as your decor. Oh my God. I can't believe I did that for so long. Oh, I'll tell too. you what. I let the, the lady decorate the new place. Furnish it. Fine. I, funny. Hopefully she's not listening. Uh, but I saw the place for the first time. 
please don't tell me it's garbage. No, it's it's gorgeous. Oh, great. But I walk in the house and and she goes, you didn't really seem very excited for it. I was like, yeah, because I didn't have a say in it. Yeah. If I had a say in it, I'd be doing fucking gainer flips off the coffee table. I'd be doing jumping jacks, yippee ki yay, bop 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 bop. But for me, I'm like, I showed up when the puzzle was two pieces away from being done. Yeah. It's hard for me. I signed my name on yeah. the group project. I didn't do shit. So it's hard for me to be excited for it when I'm just like approving it. You know, I'm like, yeah, that's great. Look, that looks, that looks, that looks awesome. But it, had I been a, a, a part of it since day one, you're like, oh, we got the couch we wanted. Oh, we got the, the fucking paintings. Yeah, you don't know the story behind all the guests. I, exactly. I, yeah, don't, right. I don't know all the work that went into it's it. It's like being excited when you walk into a hotel room. That's what I said. I was like, really? No, I was, I was literally like, it's like, yeah, this is cool. Because from my role in this, from what I understand, is just be like the yes guy. Be like, yeah, for sure. That works. Perfect. Yeah. But for me to not be excited about it, it's like, I didn't have a say in it. Did I want to say in it? I didn't no. really care. I didn't want, I don't want to spend all the time between touring and all this to focus on this. Sometimes you just got to fake the funk, bro. But, but, but I guess where that's where it was, is like, did, did, I thought I gave a very genuine reaction. I was like, oh. yeah, this is great. We can do that. We can do this. Perfect. Yeah. It was very like, check mark, check mark, check mark. This right. looks great. Like not, she wanted an emotional yippee ki but, but it's like, I think, and I compared it to this when I was talking to my therapist who has been very Get helpful. Um, oh yeah. But it's like, I don't know. It, sometimes you just want that validation. Yes. I think she just wanted more like, damn, you really put in these 20 hours that fucking those last two days, you've been busting your asses. This looks great. And I do think it does look really good. Yeah. But for me, I was like, I, I didn't, yeah, it looks it's exactly how you envision it for me. Yeah. It's like when you get off stage and you're like, oh, I just had the set of my life. Uh huh. And then you walk into the green room. Somebody's like, so where should we get food after this? You're like, food? Compliment me. Say Suck my d I did nine callbacks. Nine. <laughs> say holy crap. I got a standing Your ovation. Your Chappelle. Just say it. And that's, a, that's the exact same thing. And that's what it is. It was just like. You want to be validated inside, and when when they don't hit that, or they don't hit it to a, a level that you want, you're yeah. like more. I need more. More. I yes. I need so, a cake. Yeah. I need a cake. I need you to sing to me. Streamers, balloons. Let's go. Yeah. Ultimately, it it was just it was hard for me, and it's not it's not fully fully done. There's a few things that are still on their way. Right. So it's like it's hard for me to see the full picture because one, I'm not planning the damn thing, and two, not everything's there. You, she probably has so much fun doing that. Yeah, this is a passion project for her. Oh, this was, great. it was like I tried to get involved for little things and then I, I, my thoughts were fucking up her like overall design. Yeah. So I was like, I, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just stay I'm up. gonna stay on the sidelines. Stay on the sidelines. I'll let you be the quarterback. But it's hard for me to get excited for that because it's not my vision, it's hers. But I right. agree with her vision. Right. No, dude, I, I, yeah, I, I totally, I totally, I totally agree. I think so. It's hard to just communicate that and be like, I'll, I'll be excited if once it's fully done. But right now it's like, you, you're, you're the chef. I'm the guy at the table. Yeah. You're and still whipping and flipping. It smells great. Right, right, right. But I don't know what, when it's making. I have this. no idea. And you have the vision. You already know what it's going to look like. I have no idea what it's going to look like. Right. Yeah. Girlfriends, huh? Can't live with them. Hey. Can't shoot them in the fucking face in front of their goddamn family. Can't do that. Maybe you can't. You can actually. Isn't it funny <sighs> that you you actually can do anything? You can do anything. You literally can. I mean, there's, there's repercussions. repercussions. Yeah. But you, you can shoot anything. You shouldn't. You could you shouldn't shoot somebody. Sh absolutely bad, bad, shouldn't. Bad. Bang, bang, bang. What are you saying? You can't go to Staples. You can go to Staples Center. You could tackle LeBron James. You can do that. Yeah. But then you go to prison. There's a lot of logic flaws in a lot of this but who are those guys that are in a game and they're in the stands and they go you know what i'm gonna do next i'm gonna get asshole naked and run down on the field legends are they no they they're I mean, the people that should always wear condoms yeah that's someone's dad and that's the crowning moment of that person's life yeah that's that's peak they go it's, it's the attention it's the fuck it i got nothing else going on and i'm just tired of working every single day at Baja Fresh and I need to freshen up my goddamn life and they go run they just run I mean you don't you, yeah I don't there is no end goal it's just adrenaline and then you do the thing and then the security guards are chasing you and you're like oh I'm kind of fucked yeah I mean the amount of times the amount of things I did in college where I like what I was like I got to be sober and I was like what why the fuck did oh, I yeah. do that Dude, I saw one the other day this guy got clocked he got the I was a baseball field I think 
he, the guy ran on the field and didn't see his security guard on the right hand side of him, and the dude laid him out. Oh no, that's got to be their dream. Oh yeah. Also, it's like the guy got like ten yards of running and then just got clocked. So it's like, it's funny when the old umpires have to chase them and they're like out of breath and they're like doing laps around. This yeah, dude yeah. straight up got like step, 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 bang, CTE. Dude, did you see that cat that fell off the thing and then? I did. That was crazy. Yeah. Good for that cat. Is it alive? Pro- cats are. Cats yeah. are. Do they crazy. really have nine lives? Is that a real thing? Yeah. Do they? Because if I run over with a Volvo, it has one life. (laughs) Uh, Do cats? Yeah, that is weird. Cats can literally, a cat can never commit suicide. Every time he tries to jump off a building. Oh, that's so sad. What do you mean? No, I'm saying if he tries to jump off a building. No, that's what I'm saying. It's sad for them. They want to end their lives. They don't like it. But but cats are so (laughs) scatterbrained. They'd be like, wait, what's down there? Oh, shit. Is that a a, a leaf that just moved? (laughs) Probably an animal. And then they jump. And they land and they're like, oh, okay. And then they, there's there's a, a video I saw where one fell off like a ten story building, and then it just walked away. Everyone's no, like, oh, everyone's like, oh my god! And then it just walks away. Gabe, can you look how how high a cat can jump off and be fine? I'm sure it's like different for every cat. This video. I, the only reason I know this video is because Tony Baker, very funny man, god, did a voiceover blurs. on it. Oh, uh, the the video I was talking about. Maybe that's the one. Yeah, it was like at a soccer game or something, I think. Maybe. Mm, oh, that's a different one. But I know which one you're talking about. Oh, yeah. It was like, it, yeah, it was like a, like a stray cat or whatever. And it was like holding on. I would hope it was a stray cat. I don't know whose cat would just be like, I'm out. <laughs> this says eight feet without injury. Eight, eight feet? feet? But think about the size comparison. Oh, I know. That is like us just falling out the Seattle Space Needle. Is that what it's what called? What the hell is that for? To <laughs> sit is, on? What is anything for? What's the space? Like, all right, whatever. All right. Oh, so, no. What are you do- oh, no. What are you doing? <laughs> There's just a thumbnail that says, guy kicks cat. 20 seconds. I hate people that take, like, that hurt, hurt animals. It's so fucked. I don't, I, I, yeah. That and bullying makes me fucking livid, dude. What is it, 132 cats? They did a study on 132 cats. False from... They, they made 132 cats fall? That's fucked up. Yeah. 90% experience, what does that say? Thoracic injuries. Thoracic force injuries. trauma. That's falling Jurassic? from 5.5 stories. Jurassic Park. What a great movie. Do you know we don't know how dinosaurs sound? Just going to my bit. Um, <clears throat> all right. Well, should we jump in a little? Sock a little bit of sock talk. Let's do it, baby. Me. Yeah, we got a question here. This is from Jordan Brown, and he says, when you pee, do you keep your balls in or out? In. But you fucking, you do like kettlebell squats when you like pee. You like get down in there. You dip yeah. it down in there. Yeah. It really just depends on the mood I'm in and the type of pants I have on. You yes. know what I found myself doing the other day? I can't wait. Coming on the ground. No, but we're getting closer to that direction. Fuck yeah. I was showering with my back towards the water, kind of holding myself a little bit. It feels good. But I realized when you say holding yourself, it sounds aggressive. I think I just crossed my arms. I, the, the arms are clenched up. I'm like a fighting Irish who's not ready to spring yet. Oh, no. My, my hands are just, very I'm right here. You know, hands, yeah, yeah. hands are kind of just like in a, in a fist. What's nice about that, too, is the water kind of pools on your, the warm water yeah. kind of pools on your arms a little bit. Yeah. Why is everyone making fun of me? You guys were both off but board. But the way you said it, when you say holding yourself in a hot shower, that, that sounds, sounds hot. It sounds like some early R&B tracks. Oh, holding speak- myself in the shower. Speaking of, I didn't tell you guys, we had our first shower sex recently. Huh? Yeah. What the fuck y'all been doing? Oh, oh, I'm not a big shower guy. I'm not a big shower sex guy. There's no room. <laughs> you like fucking dead in sex and weird. There's, I don't have, there's no room. I need room. I need to spread legs. I need to eat vulva. I need to get in there. Yeah. You know, yeah. I need to make the fucking pizza. Well, well, it's a different kind of sex in the shower. Yeah, bad. <laughs> Is that how it was? No, it's actually, I, and I say all this to say that it was actually phenomenal. You know yeah. why? Because first of all, she'd loofed me down. <laughs> Scrub, scrub, scrub. Dude, splish, me. splash. I was, I was taking, taking a bath. bath. Dude, she was she loofing me all up. You ever been washed? Yeah. I'm a, oh, you have? Yeah, Probably. Well, dude, it felt it so by good. By my mom when I was seven, but yeah. Oh, man, I'd like to get washed by your mom. So, they, so she, what? What? Nothing. Right. So she scrub, scrubbled me up, dude. You got my feet, everything. Pre or post? Come. Huh? Pre or post nut? Oh, pre. I was pre? rock oh. hard. 
rocked up, up. scrub a dub yeah i was rocked up damn she needed to get more uh bath jokes she needed to get my cock gold it was so big jokes <laughs> <laughs> So so she did that. And then the good part about it is, and I scrub and scrub her. So she was all sudded up. Yeah. And then she turned. <laughs> yeah. And then I. <laughs> You're skipping some pieces here. Am I? You said she turned and then, yeah. What does that oh, mean? There's a gap in well, the middle. I'm just saying she was all loop, lubed up. You Essentially. Loofed, loofed up. Loofed it up. Loofed it up on so a she Saturday was, afternoon. Yes. She was all like, she was just lube essentially was all over her body. Yeah. So then when she turned around to take it in the cooler, but reverse style. <laughs> she's standing up, she's facing the wall. You're yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's perfect height for that. Cause I ain't tall. I didn't have to, I didn't have to go with my tiptoes. <laughs> Woo, <laughs> that's great. You put two bars of soap under your feet. You got stilettos, stilettos, pumps, and the shower. Dude, I stood on shampoo bottles, funny. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, no, but I didn't have to. And right. then, so, and it was all lubed up already. So I was slip sliding in there like a guy, like it was, it was phenomenal. Yeah, Everything great. was wet. That's a, that's a, that's a go-to for us. Oh, you, oh, I love it. Yeah. And then I sat on the tub. What? Yeah, in the tub. What? Are we not supposed to do that? What? I sat in the tub. Why? Well, we turned the water off because it was getting in her hair. What is happening? What, oh. what do you mean? The shower was getting in her hair? Yeah, it was too wet. She didn't want to get her hair wet. Oh, girls always do that shit. Yeah, girls well, can't live with them, can't shoot them in front of their family. <laughs> you know how the old saying goes? So we turned the shower off and I sat in the tub. But like water. No, like, there's no like, water. It was, a little, it was just getting a little cold. a bath with no water? It was getting a little cold. You're taking a boneless bath? <laughs> so I sat in the tub like this and then she got on top of me. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, there we go. You know what warmed me up? The cooter. <laughs> I yeah, was like, but I like to do that one with a little bit of water in it. The surfboard, the surfboard, <laughs> riding on that, that way. Yeah. Oh that's shit. That's what the song meant. Isn't it weird that even if your wife is Beyonce, at some point you go yuck. That's weird. <laughs> at some point, Beyonce's like, so Jay Z, you want to get this couscous? And he couscous. goes, couscous. And he goes, nah. Wild. It's crazy. It's sad to be honest. Was he, he cheated on her, right? Yeah, a bunch. Still does. Cheating on Beyonce. Wow. No, but that's but that's my point. That's just a super sad thing. Yeah. It's not sad, but it's just like human nature. Like I would I would get tired of fucking Gabe. At some point. I'll get tired. I'll be like, I'm done. I don't Tap know. out. He's got good eyes. Anyways, I just want to let you know that I fucking Do we do a shower. question? Well, there you go. What the hell is the question? Oh yeah, the question was just do you keep do you oh, put your balls sack, out when you sack pee? in, sack out. Sack, yeah. We know that Michael sack, pees sack. through his gym shorts. If I have gym shorts on. Yeah. If I have jeans on, I can't do that. Yeah, so if you have jeans on, are you going Full balls out? No, 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 no. Balls Just in. Balls in. People going balls out? That's kind of nuts. That's like a Wait. guillotine for your cock. Kind of nuts. Nuts. Hey, Kick it. baby Ruth. Uh, You're not taking your balls out, are you? No. Yeah, no. Man, no sense. Yeah, just take your... Just, why, why do you need your balls? Your balls ain't yeah. leaking urine. They no need to unpack everything. No, we're going on vacation again. Yeah. Why are you gonna take the shoes out? Yeah. You don't need to leave the shoes in the in the suitcase. Yeah. Samsonite, pack it up. <laughs> Gabe, do you take your balls out? No, I don't take my balls out. I've been having a kind of this new problem though, where wow, I the, the place that I'm living in now is the first place I've ever lived in where I have my own bathroom attached to my bedroom. Gang shit. And Hell so yeah. so the longer that I was living there, I started doing this thing where I was like, you know, at first you you walk into the into the bathroom, lift up the toilet seat, yeah. take it out go to the bathroom yeah. but as i was like this is my bedroom no one's in here i would just like as i would start doing the steps as i'm walking in there so like i would like start. take my dick out like as i'm walking into yeah, the bathroom yeah, yeah, yeah. and then it kept getting like further and further back so i'm like i <laughs> opened the door to my kitchen? bedroom making well, an omelet oh i gotta pee do, do, do. but i almost i caught myself recently like walking into like a public bathroom and i was Doing about it? to just take <laughs> my dick out and i was what, like wait, 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 it sounds all you know it, it was like a some kind of a random public bathroom but um, okay but I managed to, to keep it in the pants for then. But That's very funny. Yeah, whenever I'm home alone, sometimes I don't, I just don't put my belt back on. I'll just t do the top button, pants undone. I'm like, I'm going to bed in like an hour or so. I'll just have the belt chilling, unzipped, yeah, ready to get frisked. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Absolutely nothing wrong with that. I sit down when I pee because <laughs> this, this is America and I do what I want. And there's no way that someone can tell me, no way that someone can tell me that standing while peeing is more comfortable than seated. Because I'll tell you what, when you sit down, you can have both of your hands on your phone 
And that is efficient. Yeah. Well, you're wrong. Anyways. Whoa! What's, no, uh, what's next? Yeah, let's do a secret talk. Um, sure. This is a anonymous submission that says, one of my old soldier buddies would melt gummy bears and wrap them around his dick. He would let him harden back up, and then his girlfriend would go to town on it. Whoa. Whoa. Wait. Hold Hot on. Hot gummy bears? He would make a gummy bear condom? He would like make a gummy bear mold of his dick. Gummy it sounds bear like. back. Right. Jesus. Yeah, Holy shit. That's incredible. So you heat them up and then you wait till they're not hot, hot, but enough to mold. And then she would just see how many licks it takes to get to the center of the, ah. Uh! All right. I mean, how many times, I'm in. how many times did he mess up with the temperature before he got it right? I mean, cause you know, he started yeah. too high. He started like yeah, yeah. 45 yeah, but seconds if, but in the microwave. It's a little warm. You're like, oh, God damn. I, I see, mean, I thought that was going a different direction. I thought he turned it into a flashlight. Flashlight, yeah, yeah, that's what I would do. It also seems way inefficient to use gummy bears like, rather than just doing like a fruit by the foot. It's already sort of like, yeah, you can super wrap. No, that what, is true. The fruit by the foot's perfect. You can make a sarcophagus with your cockolas. Fruit by the foot sounds so good right now. Oh my god, any food. What's better, fruit right by now. the foot or fruit roll up? Wow, fruit by the foot. I can't I'm gonna make a bold statement, dude. Fruit roll ups are so good. They had they had more flavors than fruit by the foot. <sighs> Should we go get fruit roll-ups after this? Oh, it's definitely fruit roll-ups. Because fruit roll-ups are like almost a little more brittle. They're like they're a little brittle. chewier. Like we should uh, definitely get these. Uh, what was the other fruit roll-up? Fruit roll-up, but fruit roll-up had so many great. What was flavors. the other one? Fruit by the foot. Fruit, fruit by the foot. Fruit, fruit roll-up. Fruit roll-ups. Uh, that little paper when you peel them off. I like the chewiness of the fruit roll-up more. It tastes more like a gusher, but you can't go wrong with with a motherfucking fruit by the foot. Fruit by the foot. Well, foot. Shit. You should put fruit by the foot on your foot. Yeah. That yeah. should be the name of my first special. Fruit by, fruit the, by the foot. Fetish. Um Yeah, I don't yeah, even know. Fruit roll-ups are they, they fucking they hit. They're just I'll, dense. I'll tell you though, this is problem if you have like dental issues. But the fruit roll up, I'm sorry, the fruit by the foot, pretty soft. So you don't have to worry about that. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, like you'll yeah. lose a feeling if you have a fruit roll up. The roll ups are a little tougher, but they're they're good tough. Fruit by the foot hits. I don't give a shit. Those are I get so much nostalgia looking at this picture. Yeah, me right too. Here. Dude, do they still sell these? Yo, oh, yeah. Really? Bro, they, when was the last time you had Gushers? <gasps> I had Gushers recently. They're amazing. Dude. If there's ever a reason why I go into traditional Hollywood, it's for the craft table. Just so I can get the goddamn Gushers and fruit snacks. What do we do? Do we get Gushers, Fruit by the Foot, or our or, or, uh, Fruit Rolls right mm, now? Let me guess. All. Wow. Let's All do it. I'm honestly down. Just so good. Let's go. Well, ladies and gents, that is another That's installment. That's been another installment of Stiff Socks Podcast. Starring well, Gabe. That's it. Please rate, share, subscribe, and Review. jerk off with a gusher. And as a friendly reminder, we have a Patreon for extra episodes for only $5 a month. That's the price of a cup of coffee go get it and you get access to the entire back catalog of patreon with crazy historical episodes such as interview gabe interview trav's girlfriend they're insane uh and you get access to the discord so go do it five dollars a month go to patreon.com backslash stiff socks pod go do it um and as i always say thank you so much for being part of this community we love you and we would not be here if it wasn't for you so really truly from the bottom of our heart thank you so much and have a great Night, day, whenever you're listening. Guys, we'll be in Tahiti. Goodbye.